Hi, I'm Rina from Accessibility's Services Department, and today we'll be learning how to add a new project to the Services Dashboard. Firstly, you'll need to log in to your Accessibility account. This can be done by going to accessibility.com and simply clicking Login in the top right menu over here. Once you've logged in, you'll see the different services that Accessibility has to offer in the menu at the top of the page, and you'll need to select My Projects. This will then bring you to the Access Services dashboard, where you can simply press Start a Project under the Manage Your Projects section to begin the request. A modal window should appear with a short form, where you'll be able to complete the fields that are required to get the request processed. Start by naming your project and filling the Name Your Project input field, which can be as simple as the company or application name, so in this case, we'll use Accessibility. You then need to select the project type, so whether it's PDF remediation, media remediation, expert audit, a VPAT, user testing, or a widget inspection, pick the option that is relevant for your project. In this case, I'm going to select the expert audit. Now I just need to add some information about the project in the text area labeled, tell us about your project. So I'm going to write a brief description explaining what I need. I'm looking for an audit of our main website so that our development team can identify and fix any inaccessible components in our application. Ensure to provide login credentials if required so that our team can access web pages that require authentication and include them in your final quote. Now there is one last step, which is to provide any links that may be relevant to the project. So whether it's a direct website link, links to certain pages where your media or files are located, or any subdomains, you can enter this information in the field labeled Add Your Projects Links. If you have more than one link, select Add Another Link to add as many as you need. Once that's done, simply press Get a Quote at the end of the form. Now your quote has been sent over to our experts. You'll be able to track the progress from within your dashboard in the table under Manage Your Project and via email notifications. The quote normally takes up to 48 hours, and you'll be able to monitor the status of your quote as it changes via the table column labeled Status. Once your quote is ready, the status will change to Requires Quote Approval. You can now view and manage your quote by selecting Manage under the Action column. This will open up a pop-up window where you can see your quote, configure billing methods, and provide payment. Enter your preferred billing method and press Confirm Payment and Start Project to proceed with the payment and get the project started. Once the purchase has been confirmed, our team will begin to work on the service you've requested, and the status of the project in the dashboard will change to In Progress, meaning they're working on it. Once the project is completed, the status of the project will be updated to Done, and you will also receive a notification in your email. You will then be able to view and download the finished project by once again selecting Manage under the Action column. Your project manager will be in touch with you to ensure you received your deliverable and to assist with anything else that may be required, and will be your primary contact in case you do in the future. So that's it. Really simple and easy to do. If you have any questions, you can contact our services team by clicking the link in the video description. I look forward to seeing you in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching.